Hey guys, so today we're on the floor and uh, we're going to be doing something with this MacBook. You've probably seen this in many videos that I've made in the past. For example, the videos where I try to edit on this thing. So I said in the Enzo Reviews episode of the MacBook, which please don't watch that, those videos are so bad. I said that I could downgrade the MacBook to OS X Tiger. I had already done it, I had shown a, a picture of the MacBook already on Tiger. But I never actually made a full video about it, so now I can. We're going to be using this disc right here. We're going to put it inside the MacBook, and uh, we're going to go from there. Yeah, uh, the disc drive sounds like that. Here, as you see on the screen, uh, we have the install OS X and bundled software. So we're going to double-click that. OS X Tiger. Click the button below to restart your computer and begin the installation process. Now we're gonna restart the computer. Okay, here we are at the installation screen. We're gonna use English as the main language. Welcome to the Mac OS X installer. We're gonna click continue. And we're gonna agree to this even though no one reads this thing. Options. Uh... Yeah, that'll work. The software you're installing requires additional installation disks. Please have these disks ready. The second macOS 10 install disk, which I will get right now. Alright, I have the disk. Let's continue. There's a checking thing for the installation CD just to make sure it's like a legit disk. But I already know it's a legit disk, so we're gonna click skip. It seems to be verifying the destination volume. Hopefully this won't take too long. I'll probably come back when it finishes. Uh, until then, I will see you guys later. The first part of the writing is complete. Installing essentials. This shouldn't take long. Never mind. Oh gosh, that's gonna take a long time. So it actually seems like the countdown is going down really fast. So it doesn't actually seem like it's gonna take uh, over two hours. Oh, it's installing a version of iTunes. I wonder what version that's gonna be. I think it's gonna be like version four or something. All right, guys. So we're just under an hour right now, and we should be we should be almost done. I don't think it's actually gonna take 59 minutes. All right, guys. So it seems like the uh, installation finished. So we're gonna click restart now, and I'm assuming we have to put in the second disc. Please insert Mac OS X install disk 2. Well, I can do that. It's been writing the files for 10 minutes and the bar has not moved. Uh, I don't know if it's the CD or if it's just, just taking a long time. Oh, there we go, a whopping 1% completed. Well now this is saying 2 hours and 30 something minutes. I think this entire video has already taken like more than an hour to film, probably almost 2 hours to film. This installation really needs to hurry up because my camera battery is going to be dying soon if I don't get this done. We don't need sound effect loops, please just let me get this done already. Oh my gosh, it's done! My camera battery is dying, so I need to do this fast. The CD has ejected itself. I kind of forgot about the welcome video. Mac OS X Tiger includes a built-in screen reader called what? VoiceOver. If you know how to use VoiceOver, press Command F5 now to turn it on and set up your Mac. If you would like to learn how to use VoiceOver to set up your Mac, press the escape key. I I I think I'm good, thank you. I don't I don't have an Apple ID, so we're going to we're going to not I'm going to not do that. Um Yeah, that, it looks fine. No, I don't want to stay in touch, actually. Create your account. Uh, I, I don't care for a password. Oh, gosh. Um, let's, let's take one from the library. Let's, uh, let's take this cat here. 
And it is 4.21 p.m., that is correct. Let's see the uh, Tiger desktop for the first time. There we go. Oh my gosh. Wait, that is... That is so cursed. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. I don't think this iTunes logo is supposed to be there. Install macOS Lion. Oh god. Still kept my browser and everything. That's interesting. Well guys, there you have it. That was me installing OS X Tiger onto this MacBook. If you have enjoyed, give it a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.